Hi everyone, it's Darlene. Welcome back for another card video. This is a quick and simple card you can make easily. I'm using this stencil by Penny Black called Promenade. I also have this Lawn Fawn 6x6 paper pack called Watercolor Wishes. I'm using the dark blue paper from this pack. And the first thing I'm gonna do is splatter some black Gonzai Tombi watercolor onto it. So I uh, did it the first time and my drops were too small, so now I'm adding a little bit of water and now I've got some pretty large splatters. I'm gonna let that dry completely before this next step. So here is my stencil. I'm gonna put it on top of my watercolor about where I want it to be kind of in the final card. And uh, once I get it positioned, I'm gonna take some surgical tape and just adhere it on both sides because I'm gonna be using some embossing paste. So I've got my palette knife and my paste here. I've got Wendy Vecchi, uh, just plain white paste. And I usually get it on the back of my palette knife, the bottom part, and, uh, and I'm spreading it like cake icing. Um, I spend a lot of time spreading my embossing paste, so I fast forwarded this quite a bit. I think it took me a total of two minutes. I just really enjoy doing it, and I like it to be a really even layer and a thick layer. Uh, so here I am finishing it up and then I'm gonna take it off, take the stencil off my cardstock immediately. And I have to be careful because there's a lot of intricate, there's a lot of intricate details in this stencil. So I'm gonna pull it up carefully, and you can see that the white is on top of my black splatters. The first time I did this, I actually splattered it after the embossing paste, and the splatters sort of bloomed out on the embossing paste, it did not look good. So now I'm gonna wipe up all the excess, and I just wanted to show you how much extra paste I have. That's how much I use on uh, my stencil. So I'm gonna put that back in the container for later. So I let that dry completely, and then I trimmed it to five and a half by three and three quarters, and then I realized that it wasn't actually dried completely, so it started mushing around a little bit, but I was kind of in a hurry to get this card done, so I went ahead and put some tape runner onto to my white panel, which is four inches by five and a half. So it's a one eighth inch mat on the right and the left side. So I'm gonna center it on that. And then I'm gonna put some ATG tape runner on my Hero Arts note card, which is black on the outside, white on the inside. And then I'll adhere it to this. So then I have an additional eighth of an inch mat on either side. Now I'm using the Paper Smooches uh, Hello Words die set. And uh, I'm just gonna put some two-way glue on the back. And this is the perfect sentiment because it fits right inside in between those flowers. So I'm just gonna press it down on there. And that is the card for today. So really quick, simple, something you can sort of throw together, although you do have the drying time of the embossing paste. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed that and I will see you next time. Thanks for watching.